celebrating Cincinnati's proud brewing history. The beer theme resurgence is hard to ignore in Over the Rhine. And some credit, the return to local breweries for the turnout tonight, which apparently is pretty good. Brad Underwood joins us live. He's on Liberty Street right in the middle of the party. Brad? Right in the middle of the party. Good evening, Rog. Yeah, the party's still going. The beer flowing into the late hours of a Friday night opening night for Bachfest 2014. You know, a lot of people we spoke with today said this is the biggest they've seen this fest uh, in a long time, and they attribute the weather to all the people coming out tonight. It's not a parade without more cowbell, or a master bather, or a sausage queen. Or how about a Bach drinking some Bach beer? The Bach beer was made by the monks for Lent so they could drink the liquid bread. Julie Fay remembers the first Bach Fest. This year, she holds the proclamation for Bach Fest 2014. I remember the first year there were probably less than 300 people total, including, and our music was a boombox in in the uh, Hudapol beer wagon. Up Main Street, the parade makes its way from downtown to over the Rhine, keeping the party going. You know what's fun is like the whole the whole neighborhood comes out, you know, everybody. And we're in over the Rhine and so people are on rooftops, they're taking pictures from their balconies and uh, the storefronts, all the restaurants are alive. It's just a it's a new attitude down here and it's really, really cool. From bagpipes <laughs> The parade was full of music and happy faces as hundreds drink up to welcome spring. Of course, Germans don't need much of an excuse to get together anyway. At Bachfest Hall, they raise a plastic cup of Cincinnati history. This thing just builds momentum year after year and just gets bigger and bigger. And it's so bizarre that it's something that I think is unique to Cincinnati that we can call our own. And again, other parties still going. Many of the bars open till uh, 2 a.m. Uh, later on uh, into Saturday morning. And you heard. Angela Ingram earlier talked about the extra police presence out here and over the Rhine because of Bachfest. Certainly evident to us seeing cruisers go up and down Liberty Street and Walnut where we are tonight. Actually seen a couple of people put inside some police cars at the Shell Station, Caddy Corner to us, but also seeing a lot of taxi cabs and some people uh, having a little too much to drink and being responsible and getting that safe ride home tonight. Reporting live and over the Rhine, Brad Underwood, Local 12 News.